How's it punters? Welcome back to Best Sports Betting and in this video I'm going to be explaining how to play the Spinner Zonke games on your phone, some of the different features you can use, how to change your bet size, uh, how to use autoplay, how to see the game info, all of those good things. Uh, obviously I'm going to be using my phone today so I apologize for the screen, uh, small screen, but uh, it's what most punters are playing with so I thought it would be the best sort of medium to use. So I'm going to start off just by explaining where to find all the different game rules. Now to do that, you hit this hamburger menu just below the play button and you hit that one and that will bring up the home menu, the info, help, settings, sound on, quick play and your history. So to see if the game has features, what the odds are, all of those things, click the info button. That's going to take you through to the game information where you can see everything about the hot, hot feature, what the free games are, what you need to, to win the free games, what the pay lines are, etc. So it's important that you do this before you start playing the game. Now to go back, you just hit this enter button. That's going to take you back to the main game where you are. I'm on Hot Hot Fruit today. Uh, what I want to run through next is the settings menu. This is where you change your bet size. It's these, these coins and the setting on the left of the play button. Give that a click and you'll see that it says here 15 lines, 15 coins, bet cash, etc, etc. Now in order to change your bet size, you just click these up and down, these subtract and minus buttons. It'll help you to kind of find a bet that you want, that you're comfortable with, etc. Let's say we want to do 150 a bet or 15 coins. We're happy with that. We've set our level. Uh, we press the enter button that's going to set it let's say we want to play three rands uh, we do the same thing now for these lines you're always going to be betting on all the lines regardless of your bet amount if you're betting the minimum bet amount you are still going to be playing all the lines so the lines are default covered you don't need to worry about having to bet more to cover the lines the lines are always going to be covered by your bets so let's set our bet to three rand. Cool, there you see it's changed there. You see that the bet size is now three rand. Uh, what I want to do is I just want to give it a quick spin, see what it looks like. There we go. See, three rand has been deducted off my balance. Now I want to run in how or explain how to use the autoplay. Now the autoplay is found just to the right of the play button. Give that a click and it'll bring up this menu. Now what autoplay is, it means the game's going to automatically play for you. So you don't have to sit there and press play every time. You can set, you want it to do 10 spins, 20, all the way up to 200. You can set how many spins you want it to, to do automatically. Then you can also stop the autoplay if a free games feature is triggered. So if you hit a free game or a feature in your hot, hot fruit, the auto spin is going to stop right after that. And we can also set to, we can also set our balance amount or the autoplay to stop if our balance decreases by a certain amount or if we win a certain amount. So for example, if our balance decreases by 50 Rand, we can set the autoplay to stop automatically. We can say, hey, 50 bucks is enough. Don't want to lose more than that. Stop the autoplay. We can also do the same thing for if we win a lot. So if we say uh, we win more than 50 Rand or 50 Rand or more, we can set the game to stop autoplay as well. Uh, so just so that you can keep those winnings and decide what you want to do with them rather than give them all back to the autoplay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start the autoplay now. I've set the number of spins to 10. I'm going to press, press this play button at the bottom right of the screen. And give that a touch and that's going to show or it's going to play the 10 auto spins that I set. You can see there's a number counting down in that box. If I ever want to stop the autoplays, I simply press that stop button. I'm going to give it a couple of spins before I do that. Okay, so you can see it's busy counting down, six, five, we're going to have four after this. And if we ever want to stop it, as I said, just touch that button and it's going to stop the autoplay automatically. Nice win there, actually. <laughs> and uh, yeah, the other feature that I did want to quickly talk about was how to change from balance to coins. Lots of guys have asked this. They've said, how do we change from balance to coins? It's very simple. You see where it says bet, win and balance. There's a black bar over there. Touch that bar and it'll change it to coins. So you'll see both your balance and a coin size. If you touch it, it'll go back to your, you know, betting on rands instead of coins. I like to keep it on bet amount, not coin amount. It's much easier to keep track of how much money you're actually spending. Uh, so that would be my re recommendation is to keep it on a balance amount where you can see what the rand amount is rather than this coins over here. 
So that's it guys, that's how to play Spinner Zonke on your phone. It's really simple. I'm sure there are going to be some questions. If you do have some questions, please let me know in the comments below. I'll be more than happy to assist. But I think I've covered all the basics here. So you guys should have a much better understanding of how the game works. Thanks for tuning into this video and I will catch you in the next one. Have a good one, guys. Cheers.